I'm Peter Salmon, lead pastor at Trinity, and I'm just excited to share with you that we are regathering as a church this Sunday, July 5th. I'm so excited to join in worship with you this Sunday, whether you're coming back to church or you are coming for the first time. We're so excited to have you. Uh, real quickly, I just kind of want to lay out, there's three different kind of options for worshiping with us this Sunday. And I kind of Think of it like a traffic light. Uh, there's red, yellow, and green. We wanna just honor and respect all of those um, people wherever they're at and uh, wherever you're at right now. And so for, for the red people, for kind of the, the stoplight red uh, folks, we know that there are many of you that are thinking, I'm not coming back for a while, maybe for a few months, and uh, you're just for health risks or or whatever you're, you're dealing with, um, you want to be very cautious and so we want to honor that and we have online services that are going to continue to be streamed live at 10 a.m and we've even upgraded some of our camera equipment and i can thank jeremy good for that he's done an incredible job so we're excited to share uh, that with you and to just have an awesome online experience going forward just like we have for the past few months then there's our, our yellow light folks, which uh, I know you're going to proceed with a little more caution and maybe you're kind of on the fence of whether to come or not. And, uh, or maybe you're taking care of someone who's, uh, has a little more risk. And so we wanted to create a service that had really minimized risk. Uh, it's going to be our eight o'clock service. It's going to be a mass required service and there's not going to be congregational singing at this service. And so we're excited to worship with you in every other way uh, that we can right now. And then for our green light folks, uh, you've been ready. You've been you've been more than ready. You would have been here weeks ago if we'd opened. And so you can again take advantage of any of these options. But uh, we also have a service where masks are strongly encouraged. I know I'll be wearing a mask at our ten o'clock uh, service. Uh, and then we'll have congregational singing at the end of the service, uh, like we normally would. And so we're we're just so excited to worship with you. Whichever of these options that you're going to be joining us for this Sunday. And I know that for some, uh, with online services, you may have kind of gotten out of the habit of attending church. And I just want to ask you this Sunday, whether it's online, whether it's with our eight o'clock service, whether it's with our 10 o'clock service, uh, make a commitment to being a regular attender of corporate worship. Uh, it's important that we're together as a church in whatever ways that we can right now. All right, so I got my family here and we're just going to kind of walk you through a building tour of what it's going to look like on Sundays. Here's our north entrance. Our north and west entrances are going to be open. Our, our south entrance is going to be locked uh, for now. And so the, the door is going to be open, as you can see, and you'll just kind of be able to come in and out without touching anything. So here's the very familiar yeah. foyer that we all miss, and we all miss seeing friends, but we're going to be outdoors uh, during services, between uh, services rather. And so um, as you come out and go in, here's an opportunity to get a little hand sanitizer if you like. You guys want to try that out, see how it works. And then we've got some masks uh, courtesy for you. If you don't bring your own, I got my uh, little fashion accessory right here. And uh, if you don't bring your own, we have masks for you. And then right here is going to be kind of an overflow space. We don't know how many people are going to come. We're, we're expecting you. We're ready. And we have uh, space for overflow. We're going to have the service in the cafe as well. And then you can come on over here. Here's our restrooms. Uh, we just have some screens set up here. We have the doors kind of propped open a little more. As we come back this way, you'll see that we have some busy bags for kids. We've got some good stuff in here um, that'll hopefully help as little ones are trying to pay attention, right guys? And we have some more busy bags as you come in the service here. And then uh, as we go in the sanctuary, you're probably noticing that it looks a little different. So we have our plastic chairs in here, uh, super comfortable, they're fine, and they clean real easy. They're a little bit spaced out. And we'll make sure as you come in, you'll have an usher that will seat uh, your family or your household or uh, the people that you're hanging out with already. Uh, we'll seat them together and then leave some space in the rows in between. So there's a brief rundown. Uh, there's the brief tour. You can go out as you leave either the north entrance or the west entrance, and we'll have outdoor foyer space.